Police in New York City setting up barricades and preparing for former President Donald Trump's possible indictment. Trump saying over the weekend, without evidence, that he would be arrested today and urging supporters to, quote, protest and take our nation back. So far, Trump's spokesman has said he has not been notified about an imminent arrest and no comment yet from Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg. But Bragg telling his staff, we do not tolerate attempts to intimidate our office or threaten the rule of law in New York. Did you know about the Trump initially denied knowing about the hush money that a Manhattan grand jury is now investigating, but later said he did. That $130,000 paid to adult film actress Stormy Daniels during the 2016 campaign to cover up their relationship. Prosecutors now investigating if Trump falsified documents and violated election laws. It's a typical Donald J. Trump play out of the playbook. Figure out how you're going to muddy the water as best as you possibly can. Denigrate Trump's former lawyer, Michael Cohen, on MSNBC. Cohen has admitted to helping to arrange that Daniels payment at Trump's direction and pleaded guilty to campaign finance violations. Michael Cohen, he's totally unreliable. Well, he went to jail and now he's on the revenge tour. Trump ally Robert Costello testifying before the grand jury that Trump committed no crime. And still no word on if a Trump indictment is coming, but ABC News has learned that the Secret Service and the NYPD held a call Monday to review possible logistics and security just in case. Justin Finch, ABC News, Washington.